Hi guys, Dane here and welcome to another weekly reading vlog. It is currently about half past 11 on the evening of Monday the 25th of July. I'm currently reading Pirate Latitudes by Michael Crichton. It is very good. Uh, next up I'm going to read Plays number 2 by Alan Bennett. Just settling in for an evening of productivity really. I'm seeing my other half tomorrow so that'd be nice. She's got work. I think she's going to come around before work to drop her laptop off. So that she doesn't have to take it in with her. Then she's going to go to work. Come back over here. I pretty much play Sims while I, I have a client call at 6 for a new client and then radio show interviews at 7 and 8. Each of those will probably take like 20 minutes, half hour though, so it shouldn't be too bad. And then she's going to stay over. And then I haven't got any further plans really. What's that up there? I can't even read that. Oh, I haven't got anything on my calendar. There is um, a Sunday Jam at the Art Centre on the 31st of July, so I'll probably go to that. Um, we'll see. Yeah. Dane reads. Greetings, people of the internet. It is currently a quarter to ten on uh, Saturday, the thirtieth of July. Um, it's been a pretty nice weekend so far. Over the last couple of days, my other half has stayed with me. So shout out to Shay if she's watching. There we go, lights on. Um, so we've had a lovely little time. We watched a lot of BuzzFeed Unsolved and ate some food mm. and whatnot. Um, she was, yeah pretty hungover yesterday um, but I looked after her, made food, made a barbecue, that was good. Shut up Dane, I've just liked my own fucking TikTok, I'm trying to pause it, there we go. Um, yeah, I went to see one of my friend's bands, The Phenomenots, play at the Fli uh, Flint Cottage, so that was good. Um, a couple of my friends are actually performing today in and around Wickham, but I couldn't be bothered to go out. I just had a nap earlier, and then I was like, oh, I'll just use that as an excuse. Um, and then tomorrow, Shay and I are going to Odds Farm Park, which is like, go see some animals, basically. So I'm going to hopefully take the camera along, get some nice, f you know, photos and videos while we're there. Um... I don't have too much else to say, I've been doing my um, sort of housework today, my cleaner came over on Thursday, I had a lot of calls this week so it's been a pretty stressful week um, and I've just been super busy. I finished reading Pirate Latitudes by Michael Crichton, that was a 4 out of 5, historical fiction about pirates, if you like pirates or Michael Crichton you're probably going to like it. Uh, it was discovered as an unfinished, uh, sorry as a finished manuscript on one of his computers after he died. Um, and yeah, you can tell it's finished, like, I've read a lot of books like that where people have just kind of, the author's left it half done and people have kind of tried to patch it together and it doesn't always work. Um, but yeah, this was a really good read, so I did enjoy that. I then read Plays Number 2 by Alan Bennett, which contained, if I can remember them all, The Insurance Man, Kafka's Dick, An Englishman Abroad, A Question of Attribution, and what's the other one that I'm missing? Objects of Affection, I think it was called. Um, pretty good plays. The first two in particular were really good because they were about Franz Kafka. Uh, Kafka's dick was great. If you've ever read any Kafka, the, the play itself like um, uses a lot of the same storytelling devices that Kafka uses. Um, it's just kind of absurd. It breaks the fourth wall. And yeah, I'd love to go and see that one performed. Um, I gave that specific play a 4.5 out of 5. The rest of them were either 3.5 or 4 out of 5. And I gave the collection as a whole a 4 out of 5. It was pretty good. And now I'm reading Empire of the Sun by J.G. Ballard, which is, uh, it's been described, who described this? The Guardian, the best British novel about the Second World War. And I do like Ballard as well, so um, yeah, I'm only on chapter two at the moment, I literally just started it, but I am enjoying it. Um, I don't know what I'm going to read next, we'll see. Oh, I'll probably Oz, I've got The Lost King of Oz by Ruth Plumley Thompson to continue reading the Oz series. I have a few books to haul for you guys, I've still been going to the charity shops and stuff as well, so I found two in the charity shops and two that I ordered online arrived. And yes, I'm going to go do a bit more filming and stuff, I might do some editing later if I get the chance and if I'm in the mood, um, but I want to kind of try and sleep okay tonight so that I can go and enjoy Oz Farm with Shay, so that's where I'm at, aren't they? Hello friendos! Look, he's sta they're standing on the fence, that's actually quite clever. God, look at him, he's... How can you say much already, man? He's up for it, isn't he? What's your name? That's a weird name. Why are you following us? Yeah. Found a pig. He's lying in the mud. Oh, we're talking to those piggies. <laughs> we'll see those piggies in a minute because we found a cute sheep. Hello! Is that a sheep? Ah. I think it is. It's a goat sheep. It's a goat sheep. I think it's a ram. Oh, yeah. Like a male sheep. I'm not going to feed it from there. What about this? Hey! You got one on his back. <laughs> God, I'm sorry. Why has it died? Because, well, I think they do it as markings. Oh. Uh -huh. 
cute. Oh, they did say they had baby pigs at the end, didn't they? At the yeah. bottom. Hey, grown up pig. Hi. You can see your anus. Hi. Look at that. Look at that bum hole. It's just pointing at me. Deaf pig. <laughs> oh, hi. Oh, they're coming over. Oh. <laughs> Moo. I made twitch. Chicky chickens. I guess they're not feeling very musical today. No. Insecure about yeah. sound. They're like, we only know one song and we're <laughs> sick of playing it. My large chickens. These Can are play the Buff the Orpington car? chickens. Gobble, 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 no. Yeah. Like you though. Yeah. <laughs> hey piggies. Piggy, 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 piggy. Oink. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I don't know what I did to upset you. It's coming for you. Yeah. Slowly. Have you ever picked Viva Pinata? Hi goats. Shay's over there feeding some other goats. We're down here. Should we give him some food? I fed them too much. Yeah. Where's the rest? Hmm? Where's the rest? Of the rabbits? Yeah. Don't know, I think that one, there's some bunnies down here. Oh my god, that's so cute. Hi little bunnies. I want to get a bunny, but they shit everywhere. Yeah. Oh look, they can get inside if they want to. Oh yeah. Little guinea pigs. Uh, yeah. You'll probably stroke one. Hi mate, I haven't got any food, but can I give you a little oh yes? Oh yes. Hello. Here to give one a stroke. Stroke that one on the head. Gotta go, oh yes, oh lovely, oh lovely. Very scary animal, my oh. having a nice cuddle. Oh my god! <laughs> Hello, gentlemen. Hello. Oh, is that good? Yeah. <laughs> You can get him, he's very docile, he'll let you stroke him. Oh my god! He's <laughs> like, no, actually I've changed my mind. Can you let you? Yeah, well, what can I say? Just chilling. Hello. They are all so cute. Hi everybody. Hi. Hi. Yeah, bud. There we go. You kind of twack that sort of. <laughs> Okay. Ah, Bill. <laughs> you suck. And the crowd goes wild. <laughs> right, attempt number two. No. <laughs> I got him one, by the way, guys. Um. <laughs> Saw it. It's like a little vlogging channel. <laughs> I hate everything. It's not 
cheating. Yeah. I'm just a massive cheater, that's why I'm winning. Shot number four, come on. <laughs> How are you doing that? How did you get it in one? I don't know, just amazing. You are amazing. Five. <laughs> I honestly thought you were gonna get that then. That's twice I've done it like right. Okay, this is my last shot. Gonna run out of space. <laughs> no, boo. Okay, you wanna keep trying? I'm gonna keep going until I get it, but it only counts as six. I am so running this. <laughs> By the way, guy, he's he bet me a tenner that you know I was gonna lose, so. I'm a patana. <laughs> I believe in you, man. You can do it. Shot number nine. Oh. How does this. <laughs> How the fuck did I do that? You put like back spin on it. It's doing really hard. <laughs> it's gonna go flying. <laughs> Ten. And it's a shot eleven. How are you doing that? I mean, how did you do it? I don't know. Even looking at it, I'm like, this is very difficult. I can't believe I got it in one. That's crazy. Oh, shot number 13. Do you want to put enough pressure on or you put too much? You've got to do it in the middle. <laughs> that doesn't help at all. Okay. <laughs> I'm glad you're having Yeah, I'm having a fucking blast, mate. Well, I think I'm on 15. <laughs> I stopped counting a while ago. You're getting out of breath. <laughs> oh, God, okay. <laughs> I'm laughing at something else, don't worry. Call number three, and I'm. Um... Oh, oh my god, no. nearly, man. That was close. It's because you had the purple ball? Yeah. Lucky ball. <laughs> I don't think this is possible. <laughs> I mean... The, the, it's only the fact that I saw you did it that makes me think this is possible. If I were to do it again, I would, I'd probably do the same shit that you're doing. Are you still counting? No. <laughs> 20. 21. It's too hard. You gotta put more like, you know, force into it, but not too much. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. I thought that was gonna happen eventually. You told me to put more force. <laughs> I didn't mean that much. Oh. Why do I love this guy so much? He's so shit at golf. Mini golf. Right, okay. Oh my god. Oh. Okay. <laughs> you didn't see that. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe just, just don't listen to me. I don't know what I'm about. One more go. Third time's a charm. Twenty-third time's a charm. <laughs> okay, maybe not. Maybe it's not the charm. All right, I give up. <laughs> Hello. It is currently Monday, the first of August, twenty twenty-two. Um, I have just been trying to fix uh, one of the railings on my on my stairs has kind of come away. So I've just been trying to super glue it together, and a goddamn super glue exploded all over my hand. So I've just been spending about 20 minutes trying to wash all that off. I think I got most of it. Uh, my hands still feel weird, but I can at least move them now. I couldn't for a while. I was just stuck like this. They'd all kind of, because it covered all of the joints. So yeah, that was no fun, but I'm um, done that. Yesterday, uh, Shay and I went to, hey Biggie, uh, Odds Farm Park to see some animals and we played some mini golf, I won. Um, so you've probably just seen some footage of that. Then I went to the Sunday Jam at Wickham Art Centre and played some songs with my friend Dave, so that was fun. Uh, and then I got back at 8pm and I'd had like three beers, and three beers had made me tired and I'd been up relatively early for me, so I just sort of passed out. 
um, and then got back up again so my sleep is weird again at the moment but hey ho it is what it is I'm still reading Empire of the Sun by JG Ballard I'm about two-thirds of the way through now it's still pretty good and I think that's where I'm at I don't think I have anything else really to update you on I don't really have any plans oh I had a Q&A call earlier today so that was fine I had to have one client call scheduled for tomorrow I think and uh, yeah, I've still been, I did another trip to the charity shop as well. I've re-sorted all of the books in the living room now. Um, basically, it means I can get rid of a bookcase, which I put out in the garden. I'm going to use the shelves on it as a planter to plant rows of onions. So that's quite cool. But um, yeah, I still have a bunch of stuff to take. So I still have like piles of crap in the living room that needs to go to the charity shops. Um, but it's slowly but surely shrinking and then I just have all of the stuff that's above my bed that also needs to go Anyway, that's where I'm at and this seems like a good place to leave you So as always, thanks a lot for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button if you've enjoyed this video Let me know in the comments if you've read any of these books and if so what you thought of them Hit that subscribe button for more and I will see you soon for another bookish video. Thanks a lot. Bye bye Fucking hands. They're so feel so weird. I think I got a bit more glue. I can't tell whether I'm getting glue or skin